home, but I don't want to do a grocery shop because I leave. In less than two days, I got a post-workout protein smoothie. This is the Fierce from Nature's Fair. I add whey protein and almond butter. This is a Harvest Fall greens with chicken. I'm gonna save this for tomorrow. I think it should be fine because the dressing's not on it. Best before November 28th. It's the 25th, so we're good. It's also my grandpa's 90th birthday today and we're having a big family dinner. So dinner is covered for tonight. This is my lunch. This will be lunch for tomorrow. I have stuff for breakfast and then we'll find something for dinner. Do you see the dogs? Where'd your toy go? Get your toy. Why are you laying down? Go get it. I'm trying to show the people. This looks suspicious. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Woo! It's up there. Good job. I just got a couple Amazon packages in. I finally got packing cubes. I've been meaning to get these for a while. These ones say, wish you have a colorful life. I think the grammar's a little off with that one, but they tried. This is the biggest cube. I'm gonna be doing a week in a carry-on for Scottsdale. So I feel like it's gonna take a little bit of preparation and organization to make sure I have everything I need. But I think all of these will fit into a carry-on. Maybe I'll show you guys how I'm packing. These ones are definitely smaller, but there's three, three main ones for clothes and things. And then these are all miscellaneous. I'll see how I end up using them. I also got white peony tea. This is a loose leaf and I've been wanting to make my own herbal blend. White peony was really hard to source. My other teas are in bags, but I think I'm gonna open the bags and then blend them all together and keep it in a jar and just have my own little herbal blend. We'll see how it goes. This literally just showed up as the door as I was talking. This one here is a flower essence. I only learned about these recently. The technical name of the flower is Prunella vulgaris, but it's also called self-heal. If you guys wanna look up flower essences, you can learn all about it because I am new to these. I've actually been thinking about continuing my holistic education and going into herbal medicine, herbal medicine, herbal, herbal. What do you guys say? Whenever I say herbs, people say it's herb, but saying herb sounds weird to me, but I kind of go back and forth between saying herb and herb. I think plants are so powerful. If you know how to use them correctly, they can be a great tool. I think it's so interesting and I love it. So I just wanna learn more and try out different things. I gotta head over to my grandpa's birthday party in like 10, 15 minutes. I'm so tired. For if I'd never had a problem, I wouldn't know that he could solve them. I'd never know what faith in God could do. I booked a workout class for this morning and currently I am not happy about it, but I'm proud of my past self for believing in me and in my future self because I know I'm going to do it. Tiggs, come here, come here, come here. Good girl. Say good morning to everyone. Breakfast? <laughs> yep. Okay. zero degrees out right now, but it feels like summer after that class. Workout done for the day. I'm trying to be more consistent with this red light therapy mask. It looks kind of scary. And then I think I'm gonna self tan. I might just do my face and chest. I don't know if I want to commit to full body. I'm gonna start packing. I did plan out most of my outfits already. I always go to Pinterest first for inspiration, although my outfits don't end up being anything like the photos, but it gets the inspo going. I don't know why I've never taken this out. Like maybe I should. 
I always just left it wrapped up. I take pictures of the outfits and I put them in a folder on my phone. I can't take myself seriously talking with this on. So I have a Scottsdale outfits folder and I put all the pictures in there. So I'm gonna reassess and I don't know if it's all gonna fit in my suitcase or not. I'm gonna go through and do that. And then if it doesn't fit, I'll have to reassess. Okay, I have most of my outfits in this bag already. This is gonna be bathing suits. <laughs> okay, Tika. I'm gonna bring this brown one. It's not really good for getting wet. It's like a cloth material or like cotton or something. This one is from my friend's brand, Live More. I'm also gonna do this plain black one. It's a bandeau and like Brazilian string bottoms, just good for tanning. I think I'll bring this cover up too, just for running to the pool. I just got this cardigan in from Suzanne. I'm for sure gonna bring this because I have a couple different outfit options that are gonna go with that. One outfit option is the cardigan over this dress and then I have some cream knee-high boots. I also have this dress. This would be more of like a daytime option. Maybe like going to brunch. I'd wear the cardigan and the boots as well. So just like two little dress options. I'm also packing this top. I haven't worn it yet. This is from Revolve. I actually had it in the most recent haul that I did but I think this would look really cute under the cardigan as well. Probably with jeans. I'm also for sure going to bring this dress because it's so versatile. It's just a strapless black denim dress. I'm bringing a few different plain black options because they're really easy to mix and match so i have this baby tee from uniqlo i want to get this one in different colors it's a really good quality one i'm also bringing this maxi skirt this little sheer tie up top black denim shorts for shoes i'm bringing black sandals black heels and maybe black ballet flats and then my cream heeled boots i don't know if this is gonna work is this even gonna close I think it will. So I have one pair of shorts, one pair of jeans, my chunky cardigan. This is the rest of my clothes. This is bras, underwear, bathing suits, sports bras, workout shorts. I'm gonna put my boots in here as well as this purse. This has my jewelry in it. This one has the rest of my shoes. I'm bringing this backpack as my personal item. So I think I'm gonna put shoes in here as well as my makeup bag and then laptop, electronic accessories. This is all my other toiletries. I have hair clips, toothbrush, toothpaste, a moisturizer, cleanser, and then hair ties, bobby pins. I really wish I could bring more of that, but they're so limited with liquids. And I think deodorant counts as a liquid too. I will put one container of liquids in my carry-on and then I put the rest of my liquids in this backpack and because they're split, they usually don't ping you for having too much stuff. That's usually what I do. You always gotta make sure you water your plants before you leave. This one has gotten so long and I propagated it. I'll show you the propagation, but like, look at this. It keeps going. It's still touching the floor right now. These are the offspring. I should probably give this one new water, but the roots are just starting. Oh, actually, no, that's a root. That root is still a little too short. This is four clippings. I'm gonna add these because I realize that this is kind of sparse. I got nervous when I put it into the dirt because I've never successfully replanted propagated pieces. So these seem to be doing good. I'm gonna water this, give this one new water, but eventually I'm gonna add these three more pieces to here. What is gonna survive for the week that I'm gone and what's gonna go bad? I think I'm gonna make a snack plate because I have cheese, I have ham. Cucumber, apple. What does it mean when it starts going gray around the yolk? I feel like I'm gonna get rid of this. I just Googled it and apparently the gray is totally fine. Let's see if it has it. And hard boiled eggs last up to a week in the fridge. Tika's down here trying to get some. She loves egg. Maybe I'll share with you, we'll see. Oh, you see that? I don't know, that weirds me out. Here's the rest of the snack plate. This is pretty much exactly like the one I made last time that I shared in my Instagram story, but I also had mini sweet peppers with cream cheese and spike on it, which is a nice little addition, but I don't have that today. She pretends like she's not looking at the food, but that's the only reason she's here. Okay, I do one cracker, cucumber, cheese, a little bit of ham. You get this mini little sandwich type thing. Not for you. I also like the cheese and apple combo. 
It's only six, but it feels like it's nine or 10 p.m. I want to finish editing the vlog that you're watching right now so that it can go up on Monday. I want to do a vlog for every day that I'm in Scottsdale. We'll see if that actually happens. But I feel like being good at my job, I want to do TikToks, reels, take photos, do daily vlogs. So I don't know if that's being a little ambitious. We'll see. Got to make sure that this is scheduled and ready to go so that I won't be behind with editing and filming. I'm going to try to get to bed early tonight. I'm pretty much ready. I did not end up self-tanning. I might quickly do that before I go to bed. Yeah, I think I will. But yeah, thank you guys for watching the vlog and I'll see you guys really soon. I don't know when I'm going to start posting the Scottsdale videos, but there should be more than one. Aiming for daily, so see you guys then.